Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode on the Azuminati Minecraft 1.9 server. I am excited for this episode, let me tell you that, because we're going to be doing a lot of different things, a lot of different things. We're not going to be working in the hub, well, I don't think we are. I mean, I did a little bit of work over there, but not, not too much. Uh, I have a few things to tell you though before we start this episode. Uh, Alright, okay, let's get out of F1 real quick. So, if you can see, Johnny DL is online, and... They built this um, this really nice big uh, bottom ne nether hub. If I can talk without stuttering, and it's it's actually it's a, it looks it's a really good idea, and it looks really really good. And w what they're doing is they're saying uh, there's different there's different wings that go out from each direction, like north, south, east, and west. And oh, they're here right here. Uh, they're going to the going to work, but. Each one goes to community farms, and not as far out as you can really go, and I thought that was a good idea, and th they're kind of mad at me because I, I, they, they feel like I ruined their thunder by building this guy, uh, the, this nether hub, because they were, they were excited for building theirs, and, uh, yeah, so that's the basis of that. Today we're also going to be getting some nice armor, if that's not today, then it'll be next uh, episode for Wither Fighting, and... I also wanted to tell you guys that I'm sorry that my video quality has been terrible lately. I'm really sorry. I mean, if this clip is terrible, then you guys are probably like, oh, well, what did you fix? But I should have fixed most of the problems, and it shouldn't be as blurry and as pixely as it was before. Uh, I want to just give a shout out to T-Monkey-T for telling me that. Uh, he, he made sure that I knew, and he was worried that it was his computer, but it was just me, and I fixed that. So thanks for that, buddy. And uh, yeah, I, I haven't done any work in between episodes. Besides, make a little bit of armor, so all we have left are like four diamonds, and then I went and I got a few mending books. But, what do we need to get mending books? Emeralds, right? How do we get emeralds? We trade with villagers. What do we trade with villagers to get emeralds? Anything. And what is the most, what is the most valuable thing, or the thing that you can get easiest that is worth the most, that you can trade with villagers? Farm. Stuff. Okay? If we can farm carrots, potatoes, or wheat, and trade that with villagers, we'll, we'll be set on life, because our sugarcane farm is terrible, it's not substantial, it's not good, just sitting there, being a thing that exists, that makes our base look terrible, so, what we're gonna do today, we are going to work on a little, uh, carrot and potato farm, like a little, uh, miniature, uh, fast farm, and we're gonna put it right next to the skeleton farm that's already at spawn, because this is always running, and it's been running a lot lately that now that Uber has been working on the Titan. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna go there. I think it's it's by the northern gate, so north that uh, yeah, this is north. Okay. So we're gonna go drop by there and hopefully we should be able to get a decent amount of bones that have just been sitting there. Cause I have a I have a little bit of redstone there in there. Oh, I left my wood. Dang it. I, I have to go get that now. But, uh, I just want to scope this out really quickly with you guys. Yeah, here it is. It's a nice drop down, and we got bones, more bones, and arrows. That's a lot of arrows. Let's see where the spawner is. Oh, it's just random things. So, F. Oh, are there even. There's not even hoppers. Where's the spawner? Is it over here? Ah! No. Oops. <laughs> yeah, oh, whew, that would have been a disaster. Oh, you guys are killing yourselves now. I'm sorry, I'm coming. Where? Up here, maybe? Let's, let's check on that. Oh, it's up there. There's a stairway already made. Or is there? Um. No, okay. Uh, I think it's right here. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, laggy block. So let's don't don't you no. Ow, bad. So where do you guys die? Right here. They actually die right here. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, okay. I'm apparently blind. Give me that sweep effect. Okay, this is cool. So we can just build a little nano farm right here. Okay, okay. I, I can do that. I can do that. So, 
No, wanna, let's not do it there. Uh, lagging? Yeah, lag. Okay, so if we put it, let's say, here, like this wall, then what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to go look through uh, this chest of chestiness right here. And we're gonna have to grab some stone from just around. And um, I just wanted to get a head start on this uh, with you guys right now because I know I haven't been doing a lot on camera. Ooh, pick up those blocks. Okay, so let's craft up some slabs. And then what we're gonna do, we need a dirt right here. No. No, the dirt goes, no. Wait, what? I'm confused now. Okay, I think I think I know how. Slab goes there. Block goes there. Dirt goes here. Yeah, I believe. Okay, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna look up the tutorial to build this, and then I'll come back on with you guys. Ho when hopefully I I have a deeper understanding of what this uh, what this na nano farm requires to build. Okay, so this is a lot more simple than I thought it was. All we need is few pieces of redstone and we're gonna need a comparer so we just need two more redstone torches and oh quartz ah oh, we need quartz well i guess when I, I i have to go get some carrots and potatoes anyway so yeah let's go grab some quartz and carrots and potatoes dang it i forgot the quartz ah <sighs> gotta go back up Okay, so let me catch you guys up on what I've been doing. Basically, I yeah, I I got I got the carrots, yeah. I got the carrots and I got the quartz, uh-huh. And then I realized I needed water, but I didn't have iron. I didn't want to go get iron, so I went caving and I mined some iron, but then I needed coal, so I went to go get the coal. But now I need cobble to make a furnace, so I'm going to have to mine the cobble with the stone pick that I took from this chest. That th this is this is what I have to go through, everyone. Hope you know that because, huh? That would not uh, not have been good. But let's make a furnace. Okay. And now we have to place down our coal, which we mine with our stone pick, which then we place in our furnace with our iron. <sighs> okay. Okay, I hope, I hope that's good enough for you, world, because that took a took a decent amount of time. But when this finally cooks up, uh, we'll be able to do this, because... Do we only have one skelly? I thought we would have had more. Eh, whatever, I'll wait. Probably just my impatience. And uh, let's just put down some torches. But right here, uh, as you can see, this is a nano farm for wheat, carrots, and potatoes. Okay, good, we're getting skeletons. And what happens is, when this is tilled, like this... When you plant crops on it, they uh, these are going to be going like this. And I'm sorry, that's loud. I'll try to turn that down in the video, but probably not. So, sorry, rip, rip headphone users. Okay. And what we're going to be doing for this is the uh, since this is really dark and there's a slab here, they when you plant crops, they get bone yield by all of this. But then the lighting updates and it pops off and it basically because it, it's saying that oh it's too dark for crops to grow here so you can't grow here now we have to um, pop you off that's basically what it's saying and um, it, it's really a good idea and the farm is by impulse SV if you want to know look him up on YouTube a great great YouTube channel and where's the water that we found earlier I know we I know we found water water earlier dang it did I I just did that let's mine this up and then we'll rebuild the staircase that I broke. Okay, yeah, water up here. Whew. We would not have been lucky if there was no water. But we put this here, and then we have to get other blocks on our hotbar to make sure we don't ruin this entire thing. Piece of stone brick, there we go. The slab is. What we're gonna do is we're gonna throw the water down. That's a torch. It's not water. Water! Good. And then we'll put slabs there. Now we till this, and that should become fertile land, and then what we can do, put that away, take our carrots, turn this on, let me turn that down, that's really annoying, music, music, where's music, there it is, no, 
There we go. That's a little bit better. And then what we do is we spam this down, and I'm eating them, so let's fill up our hunger. <laughs> really quickly. There we go. And as you can see... Really? Yeah, take this out. <laughs> there. So, you see we're multiplying the, the carrot amount that we have, because it's constantly bone mealing them and then breaking them because of the lighting glitches. And I can just sit here and do this all day long, because... Th and yeah, because this is just an amazing na nano farm that we will use. Oh, lag. And yeah, sometimes the server lags and that happens. But yeah, this is pretty much the farm. And look, we already have a stack of carrots. Uh, all we have to do is continually fill this up with bone meal. But that's not that's not a problem because we can easily easily take the bones from this farm. That's why I built it here and put them in here. Later on, we'll have like an input chest that we do that with and. Then we'll have all the fancy stuff. Oh, oh, that that Spencer's out. That was. Oh, this is the only one. Okay. So now what we're gonna do. We just have to really quickly fill this up. We'll grab one, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, that that seems like it's a decent amount. And then we'll fill up these guys. We'll go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then this one will get four. One, two, three, four. Perfect. Hopefully that works. And then we have another two for that one, two for that one, and two for that one. So I'm just going to sit here. I just put carrots in there. I'm just going to sit here and spam my carrots and hopefully get a decent amount by the time I start the next clip. Looks like someone's here to use our farm. Okay, I'm okay with that. My computer's crashed three times in the last ten minutes. And, yeah, it's uh, kind of annoying because I... You know, um, was recording clips when it crashed, and hopefully I fixed it, <laughs> because I actually, th yeah, this is really annoying, and it's really bugging me that I can't figure out what is causing my computer to crash. So hopefully, hopefully I fixed this. As you can see, I moved the redstone to a more manageable spot. Now it's right here, uh, and it kind of goes in and around, oh wait, it's not fully magic yet, there we go, now, now it's fully magic. And that leads for like a higher rate in general. And then this is a little area parked in the back where it's like a little access hatch. And then that's just gonna get covered up. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So let's just kill these guys off real quick. Get some XP. Seal up our pickaxe. Oh, get shot by those guys. There we go. Now they're dead. And then we'll just toss all this stuff into there. What's wrong now? It's... Oh, oh yeah, I'm, I'm on Grey Worm's account right now. But, you see this? Only one dispenser is actually clocking. Uh... What? No, they... They all should... Doesn't make sense. Doesn't make any sense. Okay, now they're working. I don't know. I don't know anymore. <laughs> I'm just gonna just gonna AFK a little bit more. So I'm just finishing off the villager trading, and I think yeah, that guy's locked up now. Uh, basically. I took all of the carrots and potatoes that we had gotten so far, and I've been, you know, trading with villagers, and I've gotten a decent amount of emeralds, let me tell you that. <laughs> decent amount, and I'm I'm surprised, I'm genuinely surprised that I got this much. Of course, I've, you know, I have some pumpkin pies and stuff, uh, I put my bread in there already, let's throw that in, take that extra stack. And I've already got like a stack and eight emeralds, and uh, that's way more efficient than my stupid sugar cane stuff was. So I'm going to make sure I destroy that farm and get rid of that stuff. I like how it just does an entire stack. Looks nice and clean. And uh yeah, so what we so this episode so so far we have done a little bit of work on our uh, on the skeleton farm and now we've put a little na nano farm there for people in the server to use and we've gotten a decent amount of bones from that farm and a decent amount of carrots to then trade with villagers to then get emeralds to then make wither skeleton i mean to then make wither 
fighting armor to then use to fight the wither. So we've just basically done one of the small things that we have to do to fight the wither. And now we have the, uh, an infinite amount of villager books, I guess, if we continue to do this and I continue to AFK, which I will. Don't worry about that. Of course I will. And um, I'm pretty sure that's it so far. I'm just going to keep... Ki ah, I'm going to... <laughs> words. I'm going to keep trading with these villagers and getting uh, emeralds. And when I run out, I'll find another small project to do. Because that's what this episode is. Just finding small projects to do and doing them. With the 15... Oh, sorry. With the... <laughs> words. With the five minutes that we still have left, I thought that we could go and, you know, check out the... Uh, sound oh yeah i turned it down to afk didn't i yeah i thought that we could go down to the under nether hub and yeah and uh work well not work on that but go go check out what's oh he's not here anymore but go go check out what i forgot I forgot their name eh, i'm sorry oops if you're watching this oh whoa if you're watching this i'm sorry but yeah, this is the Underhub. So what they did is they put a map of the overworld right here. This is isn't this a cool map? Look, that is our base right there. You see that? That is our base. Kind of cool, right? Well, actually, hmm. Yeah, I think that that's our base. Cause, or is it? If we fly this way, it's it's so if this is a if this is spawn, then. There's a little forest, and then there's a mesa, but the mesa is here. I think our base is right here, but I'm not sure. Yeah, because th that, that's the birch forest, and that's our base. And then the mesa's over here. Wait, there's a mesa right there? Wait, no, but... Okay, I'm I'm confusing myself. Uh, <laughs> whoa, that was taking a long time to get all that quartz. Oh, that's gonna that's gonna take a while. But uh, yeah, they have little boards on the ice passages, which is cool. Like it tells you where their bases are, where the farms are, and where uh, anything else will be. And you just go down here and you just, you know you do the sprint jump thing and you go all the way down. And yeah, that goes on for. Whoa, that must have taken a long time. Oh, the the sea lanterns required to make this. That's a little um, painful to me cause since I was the one who made that farm. Wait, I think I remember some sea lanterns. Oh my, that's a lot of sea lanterns. But uh, yeah, there's there's uh, western, eastern, and southern tunnels too. And there's a portal iron farm. Oh yeah, no, I was right. I, t I told them to put it over here. Oh, the poppies are going to pile up. The poppies are going to pile up and that's not a good thing. Uh, how did Tang Tango f fix that a certain way? I'm not sure how he did it, though. But we'll have to figure that out later. And, yeah, this is pretty much the bottom hub, and it's it's a pretty cool place. It is a pretty cool place down here, and I can't wait to see what it is going to look like in the future. And, again, I'm sorry for the video quality on the other videos. It should be fixed. If it's not fixed, give me a big fat comment down there saying, ACG, you suck, it's not fixed. But that is going to be it for me today on the Azuminati server. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you really liked it, feel free to subscribe. But that is going to be it for me today on the Azuminati server. And I hope to see you guys next time. See you later, everyone.